hello sweet team welcome back to my channel this is sweet Ajele. as you can see the warm weather is upon us before you know it it'll be here so i wanted to share with you all some of the drinks that i love to make in the summertime for my family and i thought why not start with one of my favorite my ginger pineapple drink which is super duper refreshing and so so delicious so as you all saw i started by washing my pineapple very well now i'm washing the ginger and one lemon all right so here i have my lemon and my ginger i have one pineapple and when you cut up the ginger you should be aiming for at least one cup that's the flavor that i love okay so i'm just going to peel the outer layer of the pineapple but i'm not going to peel it the way you usually will i'll leave all the black specks on it and you know nobody's trying to enjoy that part of the pineapple so i'll give it a second peeling which i will use to flavor up my simple syrup now the pineapple wasn't looking so good because if it was then i'll use i'll peel it properly and use it together with the um outer part of it but this one was sitting there for a while and i thought it was going to go bad so i just wanted to shave the outer part off and then go ahead and peel the inside you see all that black stuff we're gonna peel it again and we'll use that for that purpose also some people don't like using the outer part of their pineapple so this is for you as well now i'm just going to properly peel the pineapple but this time i'm not going to get rid of these black spotted pineapple peel we're going to go ahead and use it to make our simple syrup which is very important for this recipe i'm also going to go ahead and cut up the core and add it to that because that is all part of the flavor and it is very healthy In a pot, I'm going to go ahead and add in my pineapple peel. To that, I'll add enough water. I'm also going to go ahead and add in some sugar. You may add the sugar to your taste, but the sweeter your pineapple, the less sugar you will need. You can also use honey or any sweetener of your choice. At this point, I'm just going to go ahead and cut up my pineapple into small pieces. I'll also do the same with my ginger. I'm also going to go ahead and massage my lemon to release the juices, okay? This will help it become soft and easier for you to juice it out, okay? So once this is done, I'm going to set it aside and check on my simple syrup. It came to a boil and I allowed it to boil for just about five minutes. So it's ready, we'll turn the fire off and allow it to cool. And I'm using purified water to blend my ginger and pineapple because I will not be cooking this, okay? So you want to use water that is safe for you to drink. So we're just going to blend everything and make our ginger pineapple juice. 
All right, y'all. Somehow I lost the footage of me squeezing in my lemon, but please don't forget to do that. Make sure you squeeze it in through your strainer so that it'll catch the seeds and the pulp. If you want the pulp, perfect. But if not, be sure to strain it out. At this point, I'm just going to go ahead and pour it back into my blender because we're going to go ahead and strain out our simple syrup as well. And then we will mix everything together and our ginger pineapple juice or drink will be ready. Well, after we've put it in our refrigerator to cool down perfectly. Depending on my mood, I'll blend this part of the peel and add it into my juice. But today, sweetie tin tins in Yanoya Jelly Chumi. So I will just be munching on it and it was oh super delicious. So at this point, I'll mix my pineapple and ginger juice together with the simple syrup which i usually allow to cool completely before mixing the two but i had to go to work on this day and i just wanted to put everything together and allow it cool completely and then we'll transfer it into our refrigerator and enjoy it now i love to add my ginger and pineapple fresh after blending because it gives it a fresh and better flavor you could try cooking it and well you're not gonna love it you will love this one <laughs> so our juice have cooled down completely i'm just going to go ahead and transfer it into my picture and keep it in my refrigerator now i don't add a lot of sugar to my juices because when i'm not home and my kids go to enjoy i wouldn't trust them to add ice to it or more water to dilute it so i make it just right so that they can just go ahead and pour it and enjoy but if you're going to be enjoying it over lots of ice you may want to add a bit more sweetener to it because the ice will take away some of the flavor but if it's nice and sweet then it'll balance out it is now time to serve and enjoy and you could swick this a little bit to make it an adult drink so you can serve it just plain like this or you can make it a bit fancy thank you so so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video but i sure hope you're gonna try this for your kids this summer if you did please do not forget to give your girl a thumbs up thank you share and subscribe if you have not done that yet if you're a new subscriber welcome to my channel this is sweet ajele thank you so much for subscribing and to the sweet team i love you all so so much until i see you in my next video stay safe keep loving each other and remember that the love of god and family is life's greatest blessing and guys ke onamini uchemi sweete mahabotu bye y'all